everybody, it's Rain, and today is the first day of the Tour de Fleece, which is July 1st, 2022, and I am going to be spinning some Superwash, 75% Merino, 25% Nylon on combed top. So I'm going to be spinning this really, really thin, and that is why I'm using my Electric Eel Wheel Nano electric spinning wheel it is made by dreaming robots you can check it out at dreamingrobots.com uh, in my opinion it is a really really nice beginner friendly spinning wheel to get started on it is a very inexpensive option compared to a lot of the other electric spinning wheels out there so check it out if you're in the market for a spinning wheel that you just want to spin small amounts of fiber on or if you want to spin really really thin so this fiber I'm going to be spinning it at less than 40 wraps per inch so I can hopefully get a three ply fingering weight yarn to make some more socks my husband has requested some more socks he was really really happy with the other ones that I made and um, I will try to link it in the eye in the top right corner so you can see the other ones that I made they were a hand combed and hand blended fiber blend of wool and mohair and he was really happy with those so he requested some more and my goal with this tour de fleece this year is to spend at least 30 minutes per day I think that's a really nice uh, easy goal and that I'll, something that I'll be able to achieve so there's just going to be a little bit of talking here and there that I recorded while I was spinning and I will put that in the video but it's mostly just going to be sped up and me spinning and giving you an update for what I did for the day and I will be uploading hopefully every day of the tour so stay tuned make sure you're subscribed and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time I upload and I hope you enjoy and maybe you can spin along with me you know put this video on and spin your tour de fleece for the day so let me know what you guys are spinning for the tour down below in the comments and I read all of your comments and I love seeing them so please comment below I love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow bye bye all right there's what the three plus gonna look like it's pretty thin it's gonna be about 20 wraps per inch probably gonna thin that out even a little bit One thing about this Eel Wheel Nano, I feel like when you first get it, you don't, um, if, if this is your first wheel, other than a drop spindle, like if this is your actual first electric wheel or whatever, I feel like when you first get it, you don't want to turn it up, but trust me, after you get, um, after you get used to the, uh, like an Ashford E-Spinner 3 or a bigger wheel or something, I always feel the need that um, I can go ahead and crank it up. Go ahead and crank that power up and get it to really going. Because uh, a lot of people that own the Eel Wheel Nano that I've watched on YouTube, they said that they wanted to um, turn it all the way up. And I'm like, oh my gosh, like I only turned mine a little bit past, a little bit past halfway. And now I'm just, you know, crank it out there. sure that it's nice and tough and that it's you know that it's got enough twist and to measure uh, if you're gonna three plot I usually just kind of twist all three together the best I can it's not gonna stay together that well and then just try to let the slack out in as much as you can and measure it that way yeah, that's looking more like it that's looking more like it even if we do have a little bit of a higher twist on this I'm not I'm not worried about it too much
here. 30 reps per inch. And there is 40. It is smaller than 40 reps per inch. That's what I'm spinning right now. been spinning for about 40 minutes so that's what we got so far I've got to call it I gotta go do a few things and then I was hoping to get a little bit more spinning done on this first day but it just didn't happen so I will see you guys tomorrow happy spinning and I love you all have a wonderful day bye bye